And before I go to the break, we have a couple of sound bites here from the Oprah. Uh, the Oprah is it's kind of like her weight goes up and down. Whether she's going to run for president becomes a yes or no. Depends on what day you ask her. Well, I was with Mr. Buckley, William F. Buckley Jr. Uh, one day, and somebody asked him about Oprah Winfrey. He said, uh, "Is is is that the uh, the woman routinely uh, 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 gaining weight and, and, and losing it? Is that who you mean?" Yeah. That's how he knew who she was. The woman routinely gaining and losing weight. I think he said reducing instead of losing. But regardless, she's over the bar- ballpark here whether she's running for president or not. One day she is, next day she's not. But she's now gone into prayer. This was uh, the People Magazine website this morning. Media mogul, the woman who's always... Losing or gaining weight. Oprah Winfrey. I pay attention when you have that many people saying something. I thought, well, gee, I've never in my life ever, ever imagined that I would be in politics. And I've always said, no, 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 no. Right. Am I supposed to at least look at that question? Because I had enough people, billionaires, calling me up saying, I can get you a billion dollars. I can run your campaign. And I actually went into prayer about it. Like, God, if you if you think I'm supposed to run, you got to tell me. And it has to be so clear that not even I could miss it. Wait just a minute. A liberal Democrat is going to talk to God. And God is going to talk back. Now, isn't that what they've been making fun of Mike Pence for for about a week? Mike Pence said Jesus talked like, yeah, it was was Maud Behar on The View. Said mentally ill. Mike Pence was mentally ill because Jesus talks to him. You know, it's a big enough risk as it is for Oprah as a Democrat to acknowledge God, number one. Number two, then, to acknowledge prayer. I hope it wasn't in a school. And then she says that she will not move forward unless she hears from God in such a clear way that she couldn't miss it. So she's expecting God to talk to her. Anybody else see the contradictions here? Anybody else talking about God and prayer? I mean, prayers aren't enough. You can't say prayers and condolences. It doesn't do anything for anybody. Here's the next, perhaps, female president acknowledging it's not going to happen until God tells her to go for it. 